it's conceivable that our country could go into depression greater than the Great Depression. I used to think of Wall Street as a financial center. I now think of it as a crime scene. The financial crisis started because people could no longer afford to make payments on their subprime mortgage loan. If I'm paying $2,800 a month, I want to live next to J-Lo. I'm still, I'm still Jenny from the block. Buy more, buy more, more, more. Go, go, buy more. Breaking news here, stocks all around the world are tanking. You think it's that easy for a bunch of 29-year-olds to go downtown and open a shop and make $20 million a year? That's not the way the world works. You know, first we had the dot-com bubble, and then Greenspan came along and said, well, now we're going to have a housing bubble. He kept printing huge amounts of money, so we had another bubble. Everybody thinks it's different this time. We're smarter than they were before. Are we going to let them bail out Wall Street while Main Street pays the price? Taking my money and giving them to the private industry. I'm telling you right now, it's the biggest scam you could ever see. Oh, what's going on? What's going on? Employment is going to go down. Markets are going to shrink. Angry homeowners today storming the Bear Stearns building in Manhattan. You're seeing a class war in this country such as you've never seen in the entire history of the United States. They can bail them out, but we can't, they can't help us. Our money has been spent for this beautiful lobby. Now it's our lobby. Yes,